Hey everyone, this week we are back with another video. Today we are going to be putting together a small hook rack for keychains. So this is how we're going to do this today. First, I'm going to taper the sides of a piece of flat bar to create an edge. Originally, I wanted to do a fancy scroll, but I don't have tongs that can hold flat bar well enough to do that right now. The next step is going to be tapering three pieces of half inch square bar to a nice sharp point, and then bending them up into the shape of hooks. Finally, it all needs to be welded together with the central hook being on the center of the piece of flat bar. Now originally, I wanted to do some forge welds on this, but currently my furnace's burner is having some problems, so I'm not quite confident that I can get a forge weld out of it yet. That is going to be an experiment for another video. This is the piece of flat bar that I'm using today. It's also mild steel just like the square stock that I'm using for the hooks. We've got our pieces for our three hooks and we've got our piece of bar stock that's going to make up the majority of what we're doing here. I'm just going to set away, put away all these bars and stuff and then we're going to get out the furnace. Before I got out here today it was dead still, it wasn't windy, it wasn't like like questionable anything like that the second i turn on that camera it's windy and i can't get this to light and all that jazz
Like I said earlier, I originally wanted to forge weld these hooks onto the flat bar, but my furnace is having burner troubles. Thankfully, my brother has a welder that he let me use to finish the project. Seems are kind of ugly, but it's a cool little, cool little uh, keychain rack thing. And while we wait for our next set of regularly scheduled programming, it's time to hang out with my mom's chickens. Okay, so I'm pretty happy with how that came out. I'm not the biggest fan of how those weld seams look, but I wasn't about to figure out forge welding in my furnace. It actually came up that I'm having a problem with one of the burners in my furnace, so I'm not sufficiently able to come up to forge welding temperature. In the future, I will try to make some more of those, and I will be trying to do that with forge welding. Otherwise, all in all, I'm pretty happy with how it came out. I wish I had a little bit more con consistency in those hooks, but, it's a handmade thing. It looks interesting and I got the final product done. Okay, that's all I have for you this week. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please consider leaving a like and subscribing if you did. And I will see you next week. Bye!